Welcome back to EA Sports. He's Ray Ferraro. I'm James Sabalski getting set to call all the action here. Lehigh Valley's in control. Question is now, can they close it out? I don't see why not. They are obviously in a position where they've been the better team in this series. That's fair. You need one more win to put this to bed. Really looking forward to this one tonight. Don't you just love playoff hockey? Listen to this place. Let's get after it. Slows him up on the play, and that's going to cost him as the officials caught that one. Moves it around along the half wall. Misses the net. Not going to be happy with this. He's got the opportunity to score. Doesn't register a shot on goal. Here comes the official's decision. A little too much stick and body hooking up on this one, hence hooking on the goal. Yeah, I, I didn't think this was a difficult call for the official to make at all. The Phantoms will have a chance to get on the power play for the first time this evening. Everybody's having trouble getting on the board tonight, but here's a power play, the first of the game for them. Puck move back to the neutral zone. The Phantoms have it against the wall. Gains the zone through the middle. Lehigh Valley's got the puck against the half wall. Coughs it up on the play. Right up front, tip shot. Great pad save. He's sharp on that one. Nowhere to go for the puck. Gets it out of his own end. Slides it diagonally to Carey. From the left side, they enter the offensive zone. Stays with it. Goes right to the crease. And as he opts to freeze the puck, we get a whistle. Starting to look like a little bit of a fire drill in the zone, so this is a good play. Still early on in this frame, James and Ray with you. So glad you could join us. Still looking for our first goal. Good job tangling up his opponent here. And the puck clears the zone. One last rush here on this power play. Lehigh Valley's power play comes up empty-handed. We're back to even strength on the ice. But when the puck moves and the feet don't, this is what you get. You had lots of zone time, but no real dangerous chances on that power play. San Jose is looking to break out. Up along the wing. Strong defensive effort. San Jose has got the puck along the wall. Wrist shot from the slot, and that's a paddling from the goaltender. The Phantoms are in transition. Here they are on the attack. Slides it across. Stopped by the goaltender. Puck battle along the boards. Taken along the wall by Carrick. Grabs the puck at center. Good defensive effort to poke it away. Looking to set up offensively. Sends it over with the stop. San Jose is moving it up the ice. From point blank, denies him in front. Yeah, he got out tight to him, James. There's nowhere for that puck to go. Oh, well, you're not going to get much better scoring chance than that one, but the goaltender makes an excellent stick save. Still lots of time left here in this frame. Still no score in this one. Offense is on face off, and he wins the draw. He scores! She's of NHL 94, baby! Wow, did he snap that back clean. It's right on the tape of the shooter, and he hammers it home. San Jose's got the game's first goal. How much of a difference does that make? Completely change your mindset, even with lots of time left. You can be more aggressive with the comfort that you have a 1-0 lead. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Now he takes it over the line. Puck picked up in the open ice. Can't find his man. Right in the low slot. Stones him in front. Nice move by the goalie to get out close to the shooter. He had to be on top of his game to make that stop. 
That's a great scoring chance, and he turns it aside. The centermen glide into position. The Phantoms take possession off the faceoff. Right in the slot, turns it away. Big save by the goaltender once again. Really sharp, never loses sight of the puck to make the second save. Let's it go, and the puck banks off the glove. San Jose has got a hold of it against the wall. And uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. The Phantoms looking against the half wall. Glove save. Sometimes you're in close, there's no room to put it anywhere. The goalie smothered it all. That's not a very clean stop, but it turns out to be a good one. He got a lot of the puck, just enough to keep it out. More than half the period left to play. San Jose is up one zip. The Phantoms win the draw. Here's a chance right in the slot, and they can't finish that one. Oh, he's going to be kicking himself for that. The play was there. He just doesn't execute that last pass for the scoring opportunity. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. And that's picked off in front. Too much traffic in the lane. The Phantoms scoop it up along the boards. Penalty coming up as the whistle stops the play. Now you react, you go to get the puck, and you stick your stick into the guy's feet. Down you go. Two minutes off to the box. Lehi Valley's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. Well, this power play shows up at a rather opportune time. They're trailing by one, and now a chance to level the score off. Aggression will be the key for them. Slides it over to Carey. San Jose's got the puck along the boards. Pouliot's got it in the defensive end. Receives the pass. Comes up with the stop. Heads deep inside the offensive zone. Can't keep a hold of it. Comes up with the stop. I think he got a blocker on that one. Up he flares up the arm with the blocker. Makes a pretty good save here. Lehi Valley's had the scoring opportunities, but they still find themselves behind in the first. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Here's a chance! And the traffic jam in front blocks the shot. They move the puck out of harm's way. The Phantoms have time for one last rush here on this power play. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Kasha. Oh, he'd like to have that pass back. San Jose's penalty killers deliver a huge effort to keep that one goal lead intact. You work so hard to get yourself back in the game, you earn a power play, and then you fail to cash in. So they still trail by one. The game will continue at even strength. Along the boards, they battle for the puck. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Handles the puck. Takes a shot, gets in front of it. And they'll be forced to regroup after the puck bounces out of the offensive zone. Roy's taking it from his own end. And that pass goes awry. Good defensive stop with the poke check. From the neutral zone now. Tape to tape feed on the blue line. Takes it right in the chest. And the referee has blown his whistle, bringing a stop to the play. The shooter lays a pretty good deke on him, but the goalie doesn't go anywhere. He read that well. Past the midway mark of the frame, James and Ray with you tonight. San Jose's ahead, 1-0. Nice pass. Oh, puts it wide. Moves it to O'Reilly. The Phantoms take it across the line. And he regains control of the puck. Stick save. Puts it in for the goal. first playoff year, you get on the board and you can relax a bit. One timed into the net. Everybody is puck watching. The guy carrying it behind the net. I know he's got the puck, but the dangerous guy is behind you. He's in front of the net. Puck possession so critical. Another face-off coming up here. the 
draw, and he ties up his opponent. By number 19. And he's tripped up on the play. Referee's hand goes up here. Time for the official to pass down his sentence. And he's heading to the box for two for tripping on this one. This is such a bad penalty to take because you put yourself yeah. in a bad spot. A player falls down. Now you're cooked. You go to the box. Oh, he's got two minutes to think about it now. Lehigh Valley's got another opportunity here on the man advantage. When you're on the power play and you get one in a game you haven't had many, don't let the coach think. Get yourself on the ice and get yourself ready for the faceoff. The Phantoms gain possession along the wall. Here's a short pass to Carey. Sends the pass over. Grabs the puck here in their own end. They clear the zone. From their own end, trying to kickstart this power play. This power play hasn't had a chance to really get much set up. They can't get into the zone with any consistency. Now they're back, and they got to start again. And they'll get it out of the defensive end. Moves the puck inside the offensive zone. San Jose's got a chance to work the transition game now, shorthanded. Puck is cleared out of the defensive zone. And he slides it quickly to Carey. Time's up on the power play. Both teams back to even strength. Oh, I really like the penalty kill there. They were on the same page almost all over the ice that entire power play. The game stays tied because of their fine work. San Jose's got a hold of the puck. And it looks like hooking is going to be a call coming up here as the official's arms up in the air. Here's the official call. Hooking the call and maybe a little sell job along the way. A little bit, but the player's got to move his feet. As soon as you stop, if it's even close, you're going to get down. San Jose's man advantage unit will take to the ice for the first time tonight. I scored about 25% of my goals on the power play. I made a living on it. One of the things, if you're on it, you better produce or they're going to make changes. That knocks him off the puck. And they manage to clear it. San Jose's got the puck behind the net. With some open space at center. Along the half wall with the puck. And that one's turned away. Here in the late goings of the period, the next goal could be a big one as we are tied. They take possession as he locks them up off the faceoff. Moves the puck. And that's blocked. San Jose's regained possession of the puck. And he stands tall in goal. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. Lehigh Valley's got possession here in their own end. Puck cleared from the defensive end. San Jose's gained possession along the boards. And he jumps out of the sin bin. We are back to even strength. Solid effort by the penalty killing unit here. All a good power play is about 20%, James. That one falls in the other 80%. They don't get it done. The power play expires. San Jose's won the faceoff. Denies him. He got all of it. Andreoff's won it off the faceoff. Couldn't connect on that pass. Drills him. Takes the pass. Delayed penalty coming up here by the official. Final minute approaching here in this opening frame. In the first period. And a poke check knocks the puck away. And the play is whistled dead. Let's see what the call is coming up. Referee Gilles Levesque calling holding here on this one. Yeah, he didn't hesitate either, James. No. It's like as soon as the player got close, it's like you could tell there was something going to happen. It's a holding call. The Phantoms once again send out their power play unit. San Jose penalty. Off the draw and a nice job locking up his opponent. 
Takes the feed at the point. Can't connect. Takes the puck as the clock ticks down on the penalty kill. Sent into the far corner. The Phantoms gain control of the puck against the wall. Lehigh Valley's moving it into the offensive end. Here's a shot. Too much congestion in front. And that's wide of an end. It's official. Period number one is in the books. Present your ticket stuff from tonight's game and receive up to 10% off of your meal at Bunsville Burger Family Restaurant. Still lots of hockey still to come, so get ready here on EA Sports. Official has made his way back to center rice, and we are ready to go for period number two. San Jose's penalty killers have their work cut out for them here, but a nice start to the period as they win the draw. The Phantoms take possession in the defensive end. Gaining momentum along the wing. Lehigh Valley's got the puck along the wall. Find some space in the corner. What a save! He'll probably feel that one tomorrow. Now, I wanted another look at this one. I'm sure you guys were all impressed as I was. What a save by the goalie. Lots of time left in this period. We are all tied up in this one. The Phantoms will go to work here in the offensive zone. Denies him with a save. Penalty expires. Both teams now back to even strength, and we are still tied. Really love the effort by the penalty killers on that one. The pressure points on the penalty killer have been letter perfect tonight. They've pushed at the right times. They've sagged back at the right times. Gotten the requisite saves when they need those two. Looks to set up at the point now. Hammers it on net. Blocked in traffic. And he's ridden off the puck. San Jose's got a hold of it along the wall. Moved to the middle, right in the slot, and they can't connect. Too much congestion blocks the shot. San Jose's got the puck along the wall. Pokes it away in his own end. Takes the feed. Carey's got it against the boards. Cutting to the slot. Nothing doing on that. The Phantoms are on the attack. Picks up the puck in his own end. The Phantoms have it against the wall. Through center. Good hit to bump him off the puck. Maintains possession. San Jose's got control of it now from their own end. Takes the feed up ahead. They've got the defense outnumbered and makes the save. Well, what a quick reflex stop that is. Great scoring chance. The setters will glide into the dot. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. Denies them in front. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. You can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Andreoff's won it in their own end. The Phantoms have it now. And it's a quick pass to Prosser. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. And he loses possession of the puck after trying to make one too many moves. There are times you try to do too much. He's got good hands, but maybe a more simple play is the right one there. San Jose's got a hold of it against the wall. Hangs onto the puck. Manages to hang on. Sends a pass over. There's a shot off the mark. Goaltender's in good shape. There's not much room at all there, and he ends up shooting it wide. Pokes it away here in the neutral zone. 
Up along the wall on the right side and into the attacking area. Here's the chance. Fires the wrist shot. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Puck grabbed by O'Reilly. That pass goes a little sideways. Right up front. Brings the iron. Lehigh Valley still tied in this game, yet they've had no luck. Another post. Can't catch up to the pass. Quick pass across to Pouliot. Lehigh Valley's on the attack. And a nice poke check inside the neutral zone. Lehigh Valley's got control of the puck. Excellent stick work on the play. With the stop. Couldn't connect, although not exactly an ideal pass to begin with. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. It's all tied up. Swoops in off the wing to grab the puck after the centerman tied him up. The Phantom scooping up along the boards. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Strong defensive effort. Scoops up the puck now. From the left side, they gain the zone. San Jose's got the puck. The Phantoms gain possession along the wall. Oh, what a missed chance that was. Now he's got to make a better play there. He's done everything right. Now you just got to get the puck on the tape. Centering pass. And now it's grabbed by Carrick. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Takes the feed. Takes control of the puck. Pass back to the point. Quick feed down low. Net knocked off, it's mooring. We got a whistle here stopping the play. Oh, that's a dangerous chance. We get another look at it, and the goaltender ends up making a good save. Well past the midway mark of this period, we got a tie game. This neutral zone faceoff set to go, and we are back underway. Oh, smart heads up play to poke that one away. Here's a chance! Comes up with the stop. Play set to resume with the face-off ready to go. Lehigh Valley's won the face-off deep in their own end. Enters the offensive zone from the left. San Jose's got the puck along the boards. Looking for space inside the D zone. What a steal in his own end. Slides the puck over. Gains the zone through center. Keeps hold of the puck. The Phantoms carry it along the wall. Makes the save. And with the two tied up off the faceoff, a great read to grab possession of the puck. They gain possession here inside the neutral zone. Tries to the crease. Stopped by the goaltender. This shot comes from a real dangerous area on the ice. But the goalie's in position, and he makes a nice stick save. San Jose's got it, and they're on the attack. Takes a wrist shot. Big save. Pouliot's lugging the puck. Receives the pass. Moves the puck along the half wall. Let's it fly. Oh, you can't miss that. Now, somehow I got 408, James. You don't get any if you don't hit the net. Get it on target, man. Roy's got the puck in his own zone. Nice feed at center, moves up ahead now. Comes up with the glove save! Those are the saves that are gifts from the goaltender. That looks like an automatic goal. He's able to make the stop. Here in the back half of this period, the next goal could be a big one as we are tied. And they take possession. Nice job tangling him up on the draw. 
San Jose's gained possession along the boards. The Phantoms gain possession in their own end. Lehi Valley's got it in their own zone. At center ice now, he grabs the puck. San Jose's got a hold of it along the wall. Swing and a miss. Lehi Valley's got the puck in their own end. Smart defensive play there. Handles the puck. Here's a chance to set up now. Can't keep a hold of it as he's jostled off the puck. Nice pass. Stopped by the goaltender. Late goings of this period. We are all tied up in this one. Scoops up the puck off the draw. Great feed from the left side. Sends the pass over. Sends it across the ice. Can't hang on to the puck after the play. They fight for it along the boards. Moves the puck. Aaron pass and the play's broken up. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. From point blank range, locks it down with a stop. I think he got a blocker on that one. The centermen glide into position. Lehigh Valley's got a hold of the puck. Feeds it up ahead. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. Drives to the paint. Wow. Puts it into the back of the net for the goal. Yeah, breaks this tie, James. You know when these teams get locked up tight, sometimes it stays that way a long time. Get to the net. That's where the goals are. The rebound sits there, and he puts it away. San Jose's timing couldn't be better here late in this second to go ahead by one. The break's not that far away, and they want to make sure they go into it with the same lead they have now. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. From the left side into the middle of the neutral zone. It's in! He scores! Just 20 seconds apart. That's a pair of goals. Conversely, deflating for the other team. And that is a kick in the shins right there. They just couldn't stop the bleeding. Now you don't have to read body language very well to see what the goalie thinks of this. He stopped most of it, but not enough. It bounces into the net. San Jose's made their way back to center ice. What's the message here as they take a two-goal lead late here? Don't change anything. Stay aggressive. Get the puck deep. Be really sure if you're going to pass it through the middle of the ice. Fires it into the offensive zone. Takes the pass. Takes the feed. Grabs the puck here inside the offensive end. The lane was plugged up and that shot's blocked. Scoops up the puck here. Sends a pass over. Quick feed to carry. The Phantoms played along the wing. Strong defensive effort. Takes the feed. The Phantoms get a hold of the puck along the boards. Still too close to call in this one as the second period comes to an end. Don't miss the chance to see the greatest talents in the world when they visit our city. See the official leader website for details on upcoming concerts. What's in store for the third period? Let's tune in to find out just moments away.
He's Ray Ferraro. I'm James Sabolski, and we are ready to get this third period going. Moment of truth for one team. Here we go. Third period is underway. Once again, I'll send it back down to my broadcast partner, Ray Ferraro, who was at ringside. Ray, we've got two periods played. How do you see this thing? Lehigh Valley's players have to be feeling a little frustrated. They've had much of the time of possession, but they're still chasing the game. The Phantoms moving ahead. Huge play in his own end to come up with the puck. San Jose's got it in the offensive zone. Slides the puck over. Gains the zone on the left wing. Couldn't find the intended target. Completely misses on the play. You don't even make the goalie work here. You've got to make him have to do something in the net. From the right wing, he moves into the middle. The Phantoms have it from their own end. Receives the pass. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. Handles the puck. Nowhere for that shot to go through. Nice pass. Loses his balance on the play. Good battle along the boards for the puck. San Jose's got a hold of it against the wall. Roy swooping in on the attack. San Jose's got possession at center. Couldn't make that one happen. Denied by the goaltender. Here in the corner, he grabs the puck. And can't redirect it into the net. Just misses the net, but really the scoring chance is not dangerous if you can't get the puck at the goaltender. Through center along the wing. Nice feed from the left side up the middle. No room for that one to get through. Good use of the body on the play. The Phantoms gain control of the puck against the wall. Beautiful feed up ahead from the right wing side. He grabs the puck here at the point. Big play inside the defensive zone. Looks like we got a delayed tripping penalty coming up here. And let's see what the call is. The Phantoms are going to be shorthanded, tripping the call. He's fishing around, trying to get to the puck. Unfortunately for him, he sweeps out his feet. Uh -huh. San Jose's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. Well, the power play gets another opportunity. They haven't been super busy tonight, but here's a chance to get on the board. Lehigh Valley's got it against the boards. Takes the puck at the point. San Jose's looking to break out of their own end. Grabs the puck here in the neutral zone. Let's it go. Stopped by the goaltender. Right on the doorstep. He scores! Ah, the power play comes through. They move the puck nicely. And they're able to capitalize on the extra man. Power play's job is to create shots. And if you can create them from the most dangerous areas of the ice, you're going to be successful. Dead center, in the slot. He doesn't miss. Jose's lamp lighting performance continues here with another goal in the third. They can walk home. They have dominated this third period. They've stretched the lead out into a really comfortable margin. And the puck leaves the zone going back to center ice. Picked up along the wall by Prosser. The Phantoms will play it from the defensive zone. Along the right wing, they enter the attacking area. Here's a chance, and that one stopped. Right in front, and that's broken up. Sends the pass over. Steps across the blue line. Through pass ahead. Oh, nice quick up there. Centering pass from the slot. Puts it in, and it's a two-goal game. Just keep chipping away at the thing. It's such a big hill to climb, but now they're down only by two. Man, it looks like a bus depot in front of the net. You know it's a tough one when you can't see the goalie. That means he can't see the puck. The 
The Phantoms finally get one back here in the third. They deserve this one, Ray. Yeah, this is where you can take your underlying stats, James, and throw them in the garbage can <laughs> because that $10 million score clock is the only number that matters. Not an analytics guy? I am, but it doesn't matter sometimes. <laughs> Lehigh Valley's in transition. Here's a chance to make something happen inside the neutral zone. They've got numbers. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. And they'll be forced to regroup as the puck escapes the offensive end. Picked up along the boards by Prosser. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Moves the puck. Smart defensive play here in the open ice. San Jose's got it in their own zone. And as he stumbles, he coughs up the puck. Takes it at center. Good hit to knock the puck loose. Moves it quickly over to Carrick. Handles the puck at the point. The Phantoms play it along the boards. Nice zone entry from the left. San Jose's got the puck along the wall. Couldn't complete the play. Lehigh Valley's got it in the neutral zone. Scrum along the boards. Here's an offensive chance. The Phantoms have it against the wall. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Moves right to the middle. Denies him on the one-timer. Oh, what reaction. Grabs the puck and looks to make something happen. That's off a stick. Taken by Pouliot. Quick pass to Carey. Takes the pass. Nice zone entry on the left side. Puts it on net, and there's the save. And he's taken down the official's arm, signaling for a penalty. Let's see the call here. Tripping is the call. Did he sell, or is that the right one in your no, mind? I think it's the right one. He looks like he's picking up speed, and the stick gets into his feet. Face off and another opportunity to take a look at the man advantage unit here. I like this. They got together right before the face-off and discussed a couple of options. They haven't had a lot of opportunities tonight. Here he is, wrestling on net. Stopped by the goaltender. Past the midway mark of the frame, James and Ray with you tonight. San Jose's been the better club as they hold a 4-2 lead at this point. Nice play, shorthanded as they get control of the puck and manages to clear the zone. The Phantom scoop it up along the boards. And now it's over to Kasha. From the right side, he goes to the middle of the neutral zone. San Jose's got the puck in the defensive end. And they fail to go tape to tape. They go on the attack from the left side. Moves it to Kasha. What a stop as he puts out the fire! Puck possession so critical. Another face-off coming up here. Locks him up on the draw as they take possession. Puck slid down the ice. The Phantoms don't have time on their side with this power play running out. Here's a chance, a two-on-one. Right in front, denies him! Lehigh Valley's opportunity to take advantage of the game is completely squandered as they fail to capitalize with the man advantage here. Sometimes a power play is more critical than others. Oh, look at that. Here we go. We got a penalty coming up right here. Takes control of the puck. San Jose's moving it along the wing. Nice stick work to knock the puck loose. Well, the endless slew of penalties that have been handed out continues here as yet another one is being dished out. And tripping looks to be the call, Ray. Really a frustrating penalty to take because you're just fishing for the puck. You get your stick in the wrong spot, the guy goes down, and you're toast every time. And the man advantage unit goes right back to work. Hey, another power play for them. They've been successful tonight. I don't think they changed the script much here. From the point, looks to make something happen. Takes a shot, comes up with the stop as he got a piece of the blocker on it. Here in the late going of the frame, 
San Jose's doubled up on them. It's now 4-2. Play resumes as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. That opportunity is rejected. Takes the feed. Lehigh Valley's looking to break out. And couldn't find the intended receiver on that one. Getting a little too physical to maintain possession. Grabs the puck at center. Here he is with the backhander. Stopped by the goaltender. Certain saves are more difficult than others. This one right from the slot is turned aside. The Phantoms take it along the wall. Jabs the puck away. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. Lehigh Valley's back to even strength. Huge effort by their penalty killing unit. Well, the penalty kill does a nice job there. This is an important time in the game, and they answered the bell. Made the stop on that play. Right to the middle, and makes the save. The Phantoms gain possession along the wall. Here they come inside the neutral zone. Couldn't complete the play. A spirited battle along the boards for the puck. Lehigh Valley's got a hold of it along the wall. San Jose's got a hold of the puck. Less than 60 seconds left here in the final frame. Sends a pass over. Here's an odd man rush to his teammate. Stops the rocket of a shot. The Phantoms have pulled the goaltender here. They've got the extra attacker out on the ice in hopes of a goal. San Jose's been the better team offensively tonight. A lot of scoring chances, and they lead it late in this third period. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. Takes the feed to the empty net. Misses. Lehigh Valley's got the puck along the boards. And he gains the zone here. San Jose's got control of it now from their own end. A chance to end it, doesn't go. Lehigh Valley's gained possession along the boards. Now into the offensive zone from the right side. Andreas tripped up and the official's hand is in the air, signaling penalty. The Phantoms played along the boards. They came, they saw, they conquered. They're moving on to the next round. Sinbin bound for tripping. I always hated taking tripping penalties. It always felt like there was something I could have done better than that. Lehigh Valley's won the draw and they'll go to work. And that shot gets caught in traffic. And that brings an end to this one here this evening. They break the deadlock here and now take a 3-2 series lead with a chance to close things out. Man, this felt like a pressure-filled game tied at two in the series. Now just one win away from putting this away. Well, the downside in this is that this series is over. This was a lot of fun to call. This was a lot of fun, a lot of action, a lot of physicality. But being second best stinks. This is a long offseason about to start. And that'll do it from ringside, everyone. For Ray Ferraro, my name is James Sabalski. Get home safely. Thanks so much for joining us.